Alright, what's going on guys? It's Flame. Welcome back to another Black Ops Cold War video. Apologies for not uploading for the last couple of days, just haven't really been feeling it to be honest. Haven't really been playing the game all too much, but we're back again today. So, uh, over the last couple of days since I made my last upload, I was able to unlock the Dark Matter Ultra uh, Amp 63 here, the pistol, full auto pistol. You can see all the camo challenges are done. Uh, gold, Diamond, DM Ultra, you already know how it is, just smacking out these camos in uh, some hardcore nuketown. I'm gonna be honest, this thing was absolutely miserable to unlock. I don't know what it was, just this thing was just not fun. Um, I'll talk more about the gun later. I, I don't really know what to even unlock Dark Matter for next. I'm really, really hesitant to do these uh, SMGs because you have to do the point blank kills, which are probably the worst challenge in this entire game maybe i like level up the c58 or the uh mg82 or my other option is i do maybe the street sweeper yeah maybe i'd be a douchebag and do the uh street sweeper all right i'm gonna do that so what do i need to do here i need 24 headshots bloodthirsty shouldn't be hard and hardcore one long shot it's a shotgun that's gonna be annoying Oh yeah, I forgot there's point blanks on shotguns too. Okay, well, I mean, might as well get started on it. But yeah, I really appreciate all the support on the videos recently. It does mean a lot. Uh, just going to keep trying to grind out the content here. Um, yeah, I mean, we should be getting the Season 4 Reloaded or the mid-season update for this season here in uh, Cold War and Warzone very soon. Uh, I think it's rumored to be coming out next week. We get a new zombies map. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure if there's a new multiplayer map or not. And then also that new submachine gun. So we'll definitely be checking that out as soon as it drops. Um, but yeah, just continue to grind here. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. We're on the road to 400 subs. Uh, and any support you could give would be greatly, greatly appreciated. Drop a like if you enjoy the video or don't. You know, totally cool. But uh, would help me out a lot. And uh, hit that post notification bell so you never miss when I upload. Without further ado, let's hop into some uh, good old Nuketown. Alright, finally, dude. I, I spent the last literal 10 minutes queuing for this, which is something I wanted to... I would say talk about, but at this point, it's going to be more of a rant. But uh, anyways, here's the uh, DM Ultra Amp 63. Looks good. Don't care, honestly. I actually kind of hate the thing now that I've been using it. Just the more and more that I had to suffer with this gun, the more and more I dislike it. Not really useful in, for anything, so, uh, I, sure, man, I don't know anymore. But yeah, I mean, basically, uh, we got the playlist update today, um, and we still have Nukejacked 24-7, which is the playlist I've been playing this whole time. Basically, it's just Nuketown and Hijacked only 24-7, which, you know, it's okay, right? Hijacked is a good map. Obviously, I don't have an issue with that. And we love Nuketown out here. It's basically my home now. It's all I basically ever play, except for when there's like snipers, on, snipers only or whatever. But when you're just trying to knock out these challenges, it is miserable having to just surf through lobbies trying to get um, the map that you want, specifically Nuketown. So... That was just not fun throughout the entire process of this. Just made the entire process of getting all these camos way slower than it needed to be. And, I mean, we're so used to having Nuketown 24-7 just always be a thing by itself. I mean, basically ever since its release back in, like, November, um, it was its own playlist, its own 24-7 playlist. And then now, all of a sudden, for two weeks, we get this uh nuke jack thing which kind of sucks but you know it is what it is nothing you can do about it so yeah basically just kept getting uh hijacked over and over and over again when i was trying to get some nuke town for the video because i ain't playing hijacked i don't care i'm not interested at all um so there's that and then the only times that i got actual nuke town games which is crazy um they were already in progress, and if you didn't know, when you're playing a game that's in progress, you can't inspect your, you can't bring up this this menu here, where you inspect your gun. It, it doesn't work. It's been a bug for so goddamn long, and they somehow just have not fixed it. 
I, I don't understand how you just let a bug like that continue to exist. Oh yeah, I forgot this thing has just about the slowest reload in COD history. Great. So yeah, that was absolutely miserable, uh, especially because the whole point of this video is checking out the Dark Matter Ultra um, Amp 63, which I spent the good portion of the last couple of days working on completing, which I really shouldn't have because it's a pistol and its challenges are much shorter. But I did. You're dead now. So, fun times. Anyways, aside from that, uh, I just kind of randomly picked out the street sweeper, so I guess that's what I'm working on. But, uh, today's been a pretty miserable day, not only for COD, but also just in general. It's been super rainy all day and just sad, so it's one of those days, just not a good day for whatever reason. COD lobbies have been miserable. Uh, it doesn't help that I'm putting myself at a disadvantage to use the Sam 63 pistol, but gotta do what you gotta do, so there's that. Um, tomorrow I'm actually getting my second vaccination, so probably may not upload for a couple of days after tomorrow, um, so apologies in advance for that because I might be kind of feeling like shit after that, we'll see. Uh, if I'm not doing too bad, then I'll, you know, continue to at least play the game and potentially upload, so we'll see about that, but that's just something that's going on as well, and next week we should be getting the Season 4 Reloaded, in which we get, um, the OTS-9 submachine gun. It seems to be, like, kind of like a pocket SMG, kind of like your, uh, Milano or whatever, just a smaller SMG, probably shoots pretty fast, that kind of thing. Um, so we'll see how that is. I'll definitely make a video on it as soon as it drops. Hopefully the challenge for it isn't too annoying to do, so I can unlock it very quickly. Uh, but other than that, like, I don't know, man, the game ain't all too interesting. There's nothing really going on. I've been wanting to make some Warzone content here soon, so let me know if you guys would be interested in some Warzone content. Because I'm definitely down. Have I been using it? I've been using it with no attachments this whole time. I don't even know what's good on this gun, if I'm being completely honest. So, I'm gonna have to, like just look on YouTube or something. I, I don't know what I'm using on this gun, but figure it out and maybe make some progress during the rest of the day. Maybe not because I've been playing for a couple hours today and I don't want to play anymore. But yeah, let me know if you guys want to see any Warzone content. I want to kind of play some Warzone solos and try and get a bit better at it because I'm terrible at it. I'm going to be honest. Which is what happens when you don't play the game a lot, so... It's not like I expect to be good, but... Yeah, you just gotta put the time in to get better at the game, but... It's no secret that Warzone has its fair share of issues, which so does, uh... Cold War, so... I don't know. I also wanted to do some spectating videos, but I feel like in order to do spectating videos, you have to at least have played the game for a good amount of time to kind of understand what's going on which i i mean i think i could like personally i think i understand the game well enough but i don't know it'd just be a little bit weird so i'm gonna try and you know play the game a bit and make some videos on it uh, and that kind of stuff before i make any spectating videos but i think that they would be really fun to make so we'll see about that this game is going great i'm 18 and 28 uh, i'm so it doesn't even, like, actually register in my brain. My brain is, A, super just melted from the process of doing these challenges on the pistol, and B, I'm so used to it from that, just, just doing terrible. I, I don't know. I was doing all the challenges in hardcore, and I will be doing all the challenges in hardcore for this gun as well. I just don't like to play hardcore um, when I'm recording videos because... For a lot of people, including myself, it's kind of hard to focus on talking about things and keeping a smooth flowing commentary or whatever you want to call it while playing the game. I mean, right now I'm 19 and 32, so clearly I'm not doing a very good job right now, but kind of hard to multitask in that way. So when it's hardcore and it's quite literally a one shot, 
um, it's especially terrible, I would just be getting smacked. I mean, I already am, so I can't imagine how terrible it would be. But that's what I'm going to do. Hopefully we can... I I'm using a shotgun at that range of my brain. <laughs> But yeah, that's going to do it for this video. Sorry if it was a bit shorter than normal. I don't really know what even this video is. But if I play any more COD today, I'm going to start literally physically aging from the stress and anger and anxiety that this game causes. So I need to just not. But uh, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed or something. I don't really know. Uh, have a great rest of your day. And uh, until the next upload, peace.